Hello. I'm back with more 7 days to die on the maximum difficulty I can make it. In the last episode, I went into a different save and cheated in some items to mess around for a funny little bit. But in today's episode, I'm back in the original world for the challenge. No more messing around. In this episode, we finally have some action. So stick around to see it all unfold. Enjoy! Alright, back in the world. It's- oh shoot. Yep, we still got a lady over there. Oh, a lady right there. Oh, there's a dude over there. Alright. This is... Quite bad, actually. This is actually just very bad. So in the last episode, I got a comment saying that raising the XP to 300% maximum can go would make it harder. And while that is true in a way that I would level up significantly faster, making the zombies significantly harder to deal with. I think it's actually harder to keep the XP on its lowest uh, incline because I get less skill points. I won't be able to power myself up as much. So by the time the seventh day comes, I this is all I have. And I just get completely overwhelmed and murdered. I'm quite surprised that uh, these guys haven't noticed me. I set their senses to feral or something. Whatever the max is that they can sense me. And even though they're very quite close, really, um, they seem to not be able to see me. Which is a good thing, I guess, but I'm really at a loss for what to do here because there's three zombies. I could just kill them. But I I feel they'll they will easily overwhelm me. I just pulled out my torch, they probably know where I'm at. But I feel they will absolutely overwhelm me very easily. Since there's three of them. I mean, I could try and lure them in one at a time, but I, I feel, I think that as soon as one notices me, they all notice me. This lady is getting, is just getting closer and closer. Oh, there's just a snake there. All right. You better not, like, start trying to... Oh, yeah, no, he's... He's aggroed on me. Is she aggroed on me? Oh, that's wonderful. Alright, so we got... Some lady over here. I need you to die, lady. Oh, I fell. I just fell on top of her. Oh, I just fell. Oh, I'm just dead. Oh, I am just dead. Alright. That was... That was good. I think I got a chance and spun near my bed. I am up the street. Okay. Oh, I start with half hunger and ha oh good. And my stamina. Oh, that's because of my hunger and all right, awesome. So they're now attracted to my. All right, well I'm just dead again. There's just nothing I can do about this. Oh, boy. Okay, I'm going to try to sneak... Hopefully into a building or something. Without being noticed. Because I, the second I'm, noti I'm noticed, I'm just dead. I have no weapons. I'm going to be surrounded. And just murdered. If I can break these without being noticed. 
Okay, we have a club. That's... That's... That's all we have is a club. No zombies? Okay. Oh yeah, he definitely knows I'm here. Okay. Um... Maybe I can... <laughs> yeah, this is... I'm probably dead. Okay, and a crawler. Alright, yeah, this didn't help at all. again. No, oh, I just got spawned next to a bunch of zombies, so I'm just dead anyway. I'm just dead already. Unless, unless. Yeah, they know I'm in here. Did I lose them? I did not lose them. I did not lose them. Oh, that's locked. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, that's so awesome. Regain some stamina, regain some stamina. Oh, my goodness. Okay, okay, um... No, don't do this, don't do this. No, no, you don't have to. No, no, you really don't have to. No, you really don't have to. Oh. Oh, okay, okay. I have a small amount of time to regain my stamina up here. It's almost six. Trader Joel's will be open soon. Once Trader Joel's is open, I can... Just rush there, hope to get in. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. Okay, we're getting some stamina. Still a bit of time before he opens, but I think I can make it. Well, I can make it. The question is, can I survive till he opens? Ooh. Oh, this is a bit of a mistake. Sports bag. Please, 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 please. There's nothing in it. Please, handgun. No. Loaded handgun in the toilet. Come on. someone commenting something about breaking bird's nest can get feathers. Either I'm just very unlucky or they were wrong. Likely the former. I'm hoping that I attracted all the zombies in the area to me earlier. So now I'm free. to make a beeline for the the traitor. Put 
that down my Okay, so I have, I have an axe, a club, a bow with no arrows, some building blocks, and a bandage. That's all I need. Please have something good. You know what? Better than nothing, I guess. Let me try breaking the bird's nest again. Oh, I do get feathers. Okay, I was just unlucky. Oh, but I used all my, used all my wood. I can't make arrows. All right. I might have to go all in and like archery and arrows and stuff because that's like the only thing I can like really make that'll actually be of any use against zombies. Unless I can reliably put distance between me and zombies, the club is not going to cut it. We did it. We got a single ear of corn. It's not even worth eating. My hunger and thirst are just way too low. It's not going to do anything. Something good? Nothing. Alright. Mailbox? Give me like club magazine or, or bow magazine or something. I, I'll take batter up. What is volume 7? I didn't even read it. I, I just know that's good for clubs. Better at volume 7. Okay, that... That's, could have been better, but... I'll take it. Better than nothing, anyway. Oh... That's actually very good, short iron pipe. That is used for a lot of things, especially early game. I will take the bone, actually. If you have enough short iron pipes, you can start making um, pipe weapons, like guns and the pipe baton. Oh, there's just a dude standing right there. I missed completely, but he, he missed me too. Okay, it's time to go. It is time to go. The traitor's right there. I need more stamina. Please, 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 where's the door, where's the door? There's, open, open, close, close. No, he got in, he got in. I gotta go, I gotta, go. okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Please, please. No. <laughs> no. I'm literally in the traitor. I'm literally in the traitor. Okay, okay, I am one hit away. Nest. Oh my fuck. Okay, I have no way of gaining any health, and I'm one hit away from death. Maybe, uh... Wait, I put a, ho a point to healing factor, right? I did. Ooh, okay, we just gotta wait like half a minute. And I'll be out of the one hit zone. Oh, please be food. Please be food. Alright. Do I get points? Okay, it's morning. I think I'll get a point if I talk to the traitor. 
I don't remember how this works. I need this guy to get out. Buddy. All right, here's what we're gonna do. Take him over here. Go, 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 go. Close the door. Okay. Okay. How's it going, buddy? Damn. You smell like the dead. You better have money. Okay. I don't think I can sell you anything. Yeah. No, I don't have like if I I, I if I sell. Everything I have, I could probably You're buy something. On my nerves, friend. Did I get any skill points? No. <laughs> I thought you got skill points, but I guess you don't. <sighs> I've got work. Let's so we're gonna take a fetch victory. quest. Clearing a clear quest is not going to happen. Nor is a buried supplies, because a clear, uh, a clear quest you have to kill all the zombies. Not gonna happen. And the buried supplies, you just get ambushed by zombies while digging. Again, not gonna happen. Um, so the fetch quest is the only one I can realistically do. By sneaking around a building or POI. And um, somehow getting the item without being noticed and leaving. Do you have any other, like good loot piles in here. I how am I going to get out of here? I need to lock this guy in here again. All right, just hit me, that's fine. Okay, he just walked through the door. I'm going to spawn on my bed this time. I have a few building blocks yet, and one of the trees has grown. Um, I'm actually going to put these back, because I don't want to lose them, except for one, which I will put down there so I can get up. I need to get rid of this tree, because it just destroys my line of sight. I did manage to get a quest, though. Which is very good. They need to gear up to do that quest. Come on, one more, one more stone. Just one more stone, please. There you are. Now it's back to chopping a tree. That was only like 300 health. It was still a young tree. I'm going to plant this on the other side. It was pretty stupid just planting them right in front of my base. Okay. Can you repair my base? They were smacking on it pretty good earlier okay very good solid wood bridge between these trees um yeah, yeah I should have I should have went over here when I was fighting the zombies, but I was scared that they were, I was going to attract more zombies, which I didn't want. But I died anyway, so I should've just, I should've just went there. Oh, that's the crawler. Okay, I'm gonna try and kill him for some XP. 
granted not a lot of XP. He's so fast. Okay, 100 XP. So worth it. Okay, what I'm gonna do, actually... I just used all my wood, never mind. Hold on. Okay, good bird's nest. Got one feather. That's one arrow. I'm gonna make a door real quick. Might as well make that one arrow while I can. Okay, no honey from the stump, but that's fine. What I'm gonna do is make this like a little outpost area. Wait, can I just... Oh, wait, no, I don't want the... Alright, yeah, I didn't want to do that. There we go. Okay. So now I have a little shack that I can run back to in the case in case of any emergency. Okay. And a staircase so I can go on the roof. Okay. Made a checkpoint, basically. Oh, okay. I wanted to stop searching that so I could destroy it, but it just destroyed it as I stopped searching it, so that probably meant there was nothing in it. Awesome. How is my axe already halfway destroyed? Oh my... I <laughs> destroyed like two trees. It's already broken. Oh, I just realized I lost that short iron, iron pipe from earlier. That's actually... That's like the biggest setback yet. <laughs> Just losing a short iron pipe. Alright, lady. Alright, dude. Just got to the, the rally point here. Already have to retreat back to the shack. Little shed. There's two birds' nests there. I need to get those. Okay. Don't go inside. I can't hit you. Okay. Awesome. I don't have any stamina. Okay, he's beating on the house. Good. Continue to do that. No, that's not what I wanted you to do. I need this lady dead. Just die. Please just die. Okay, thank you. Does it really take stamina to repair? Oh, there's a third man. Alright, this is awesome. This is exactly what I wanted. It doesn't take stamina, but it just... Why is my stamina regenerating? Alright. If I do a power attack, I can, I can hit them both. For high damage. How much wood do I have? I have five planks. I need them dead now. Hurry up, regen! Okay, one's down, one's down. Very good, very good. There's just one dude left. He has to be close to death. I hit him with power, a couple power attacks already. Buddy! Why is he, like, infinite health? Just die. Don't destroy that, please. I have enough stamina. Let me attack. 
Thank you. Okay. Oh my gosh. I need more wood. I need to make a bow. What do I need for the bow? Just wood. Okay. I need so much wood. I need a lot of wood. At the rate my XP is going up, I should basically just be doing a level 1 run of this as well. It's so, so slow. Oh, that's the play. Get it down to like 1 HP, then loot it. Oh, that's absolutely the play. I have seven arrows. That's a record number. This is probably the easiest way of getting wood. Guaranteed one to three wood per hit. As opposed to like the one wood for every 20 hits on a tree. Oh yeah, get some more arrows. I already hear a zombie. Perfect timing. Oh, it's you. Okay. You're going to have an obscene amount of health. Which is not fun, but at least there's only one of you. How much do you do? Too much. 24 damage a hit. That's crazy. Okay. Very good. Okay, so now I'm going to start the quest. Alright, um... Hold on. There'll probably be another zombie spawn... Right around that corner. Yep. All right. It got rid of. Oh, it just got rid of that. Okay, that's awesome. That's fine. I didn't want that anyway. I forgot it did that. Okay, that's completely my fault. But we're fine. We have plenty of wood. That's that's scary. Okay. I didn't even check that before. I just went. I just was like, yeah, yeah, we're good. to just put your dead body right there. That's fine. Oh, okay. Hello. Uh, I, I really rather not fight any more zombies. get wood before I even go try to get this item and then I'm going to wait okay it's, it says it's right in front of me so I'm just gonna dig into the house and try to get this loot as it's turning nighttime I really need more wood. Okay, hold on. I think what I'm going to do... I'm going to make a storage chest. I'm actually probably going to fail this, end up failing this mission.
I, I don't need that. I'm just gonna put all my items in there while I do this. Oh boy. Eight thousand more XP to the next level. <laughs> of course, there's a cabinet here. Okay, it's only a hundred. Just in time for nightfall. I am about to enter the house here. Please be food, please. All right. Guess I'll starve. All right, this is wildly unfortunate. What is the wooden hatch called? Wood hatch. I just don't have enough wood. Okay. Classic. Awesome. What happened to my wood? I just spent how long breaking wooden blocks? How do I not have any wood? Did I put the... I didn't put wood in the chest, did I? What happened to my... No, I had that block already. I repaired the door. Of course I of course I had to repair the door. Why did why wouldn't I have had to repair the door? Oh he dropped a loot bag. Oh he actually dropped a loot bag. This is huge. We've got food. We've actually got food. Okay. I actually have food. I'm not even going to eat it, though. I'm not going to eat it. I'm going to save this food because I am doomed for death already. As I said, doomed for death. Couldn't have, this traitor couldn't have given me like a single skill point. Okay, power hits are, like, the only way I'm going, like, the better thing to do. Alright. He's about to destroy this fucking thing. Can I scrap this? Holy fuck. I have an extra piece of wood. Oh, but that was my only way of getting up here. It was one hit away. The block was one hit away. And I killed him. I need wood. I picked that up to conserve stamina getting in and out, but I need... I need it. <gasps> There's a food pile. Oh, that's water. We have water. Oh my gosh, we've secured food and water. Granted, I'm about to die of both thirst and starvation. Wood, oh my god, please. How much? 
three wood. The thing is, if I die, though, I will lose the quest. What if I put a bedroll down? If I put down a bedroll... If I can spawn in here after I die... I wonder if I can continue the quest. Where's my thirst at? <laughs> it's, it's, it's empty. My thirst is empty. Ow. 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 Now if I respawn on the bedroll... Do I lose the quest? Yes, I lose the quest. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Well, I'm going to leave this episode off here. We got a lot done. I've secured not only food, but also water. I have plenty of loot. And I'm... Okay, well, uh, this is... I'm just gonna go die again real quick. Um, but yeah, this that's it. That's it for episode two. If you enjoyed, uh, leave a comment, let me know. I'm fist fighting this nurse. Oh no, they just respawned. Okay, that's cool. Well, they just respawned on the tree. Well, that, that's for me to deal with later for the, in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, like the video, comment down below what you want to see from the series. If you want to see more of it, if you want to see it not ever return. If you just want to see something different with it, just let me know. How many deaths am I on? Seven. seven. I've died seven times already. Alright, this is awesome. Oh, see you guys next episode. Bye-bye! Well,